And I'm pretty sure there might be a ward in there, so... Something's fishy. Hey guys, I'm Shark back doing a how to play Ash ADC where we'll be going over everything like how to play the early mid and late game, how to team fight, when to go into the side lane to collect CS and uh, carry every single one of your games. So like usual, if you enjoy, find it helpful, smash that like, comment, subscribe. We took the standard runes. This is literally what you take. It helps with utility and giving you movement speed and mana. So um, just take him. Take, take this rune page. Literally, all ranks take this. And high elo. And low elo. But we're going to opt for the Blade of the Rune King and um, Rune and Hurricane type build. Because that right now has the highest win rate on Ash and is uh, number one. So about this laning phase, I wonder how Bard will play this out. What does he have? He has Relic Shield. Just trying to hit the set with some harass here and there. Uh, that was kind of a iffy Q. I know he tried to hit him with the minion, so that way it would stun. That's fine. Okay. I actually kind of want the wave frozen. Uh, just freeze the wave. I told him. We got to be very careful. Late game because the a helo outscales us. So playing aggressive now early is kind of an essential. I have heal, she doesn't. So I guess we're gonna play off that. And we're actually winning in CS count, so I'll take that as a score. And we're zoning. Okay, level three, we get the E. We're gonna max the W, then Q, then E, like usual. I knew he was gonna do that, but our boy Bard got our back. We get the first blood, and Set will phase rush out, but as you could see, we got our snowball going in. We baited him. 200 IQ, jabated him into that play. And I actually, I want to recall with enough gold for BF Sword. So badly. Ah. That was interesting set. Now, can you chillax while I attack your tower a little bit? And after we clear this wave, we shall uh, recall. Yeah, we just want to shove this in. <laughs> Trondo beats the Amumu early game, right? Like, literally. Oh my. Oh my. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Let's go in on this. Come on, Shred. Nice W, Bard. Actually. And the uh, presence of mind gives us some mana there. Alright, let's recall. We have enough gold for a pretty hefty buy. Oh, I We're not getting BF Sword. My bad. We're getting Vamp Sap. Uh, yeah, Cutlass. Because we have uh, Magical Footwear. And this will sustain us throughout a lot of the laning phase and just in general. We see a Mumu's bot side, so we don't have to toss out the E right now. Bard just took some of my farm. He is definitely not the best support in the world, but what can you do when you play ADC, am I right? All right, he literally just showed that he's recalling, so we have to play passive. Maybe if he could have recalled in the bush, that would have been better, but hey. Can't control other people's actions. Which is why ADC is the least impactful role in season 10 same with season 9 pog we're playing at a range we sustain all of their damage back up so we don't have to worry too too much about taking a little bit of poke here and there 
But as you can see, our W is just chunking them down. Our Bard can do whatever he wants. And we also have the Cutlass slow. Which is pretty good. They're taking the early drag? Nah, nah, nah. They're not feeling it. I might want to shove them under tower here. Yeah, help me take these minions. Shove it in. And we are putting the pressure under their own safe tower. Yeah, Bard is pinging me off. We're taking drag. Bard and Trundle is enough. I have to play semi safe, but I almost have. I'm almost six, so I. Once I get R, I'm sure I could just win a 1v2. Because Amumu's weak, uh, we can take first, first drag really easily without fear of him stopping us. W there. And I griefed that, didn't I? <laughs> Hitbox is huge on my R. I should have held on to my R. But it's huge. I'm pretty sure that would have wouldn't have even hit him. It hits like fat. They're both low under tower. Which means they're just farming super far back. And they're losing CS. So they have to reset at like a super awkward point. Where they're going to lose one or two waves under tower. While we farm everything. And you see it in the CS. Okay. Oh, Mumu's bot. Rip. I don't think we can fight this. No, we had to focus. Oh, set, 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 set. Yeah, get the set. Get the set and then die. It's not going to be worth, but it's the best we could have done there. If we focused. Yeah, if we focused the set, we might have killed him, but I actually focused the helo. Because, um, I thought she would be more squishy. <sighs> Gotta get the deep wards. Level 9. We're gonna opt for the blue. So that way we don't have to face check bushes. Nice overstay. Dang. Actually, yeah, I want to clear this wave. <laughs> more than kill the Amumu. I wish I got the kill and not the bard. But early game, I, I think all I need is CS. Giving your eighty, giving your support kills, it's not the worst thing in the world. And now we're just stacking slows on top of each other. As you can see. And they can't escape once we get one auto attack off. Because each auto slows. Hmm. Poke under tower. Use the Q. Bard is roaming, so we have to play safe-ish. Oh, wow, the Mumu's back. Why is he back? I'm actually disappointed. I'm just trying to farm. Not get camped. Alright, we see he recalled. Bard or the set isn't here. Let's take tower plating. We have enough for blade. And we have a level on top of the Ahilo. So I think it's time to recall. We got 7,000 gold. Let's get that. Another dagger. Replenish our mana and then head back to lane. Alrighty, back in lane here. Double the uh, Hilo CS. Oh. R? Oh, Bard! That's perfect. Wait, can you? You can't do it? 
Rip. <laughs> Rip, I thought you could. They just shut you down like that? Oh, that's sad. That's Vagar. No! I could have played that better. Now Drag is up and they took it. It all stemmed from that Bard play. You misplayed that really hard. Or he got baited into that situation there. I gotta farm and chill more. Because these deaths, these deaths are letting the Ahilo catch up. And I hate Bard, I hate Bard support so much. They're just never in lane with you. Hate it so much. And their excuse is I'm catching meeps even though they're still useless. Whatever. In the mid game, they don't even peel for you. And they just grief. Grief with their R. That's what they love to do. Alright, let's kill the Umumu. And let's take that dragon. We have Perma CC. Oh, you're silly. Q him. <laughs> you're silly. Thinking you can Glacial Augment GLP away from me. We take drag. Get two kills and uh yeah we're stomping early so it shouldn't be any other way ash's ultimate ability is what is super good in solo queue where picks can happen basically basically every 30 seconds all right she's back in lane Knew the set was trying to go for something like that. Heal up. And Blade will provide us the healing we need. So yeah. Blade makes us like super strong. With healing, damage stats, everything. And when we group with the team. We'll be pretty strong. Can we? Yeah. We're trying to head mid. I thought the Trundle would be with us too. But I guess farming blue buff is more important. Oh, that E was uh, pretty scary. Don't take my kill. Don't take... Oh, don't take my kill. I was literally focused on the Vega the whole time. I forgot about the... Amumu. Nice pick. I'm pretty sure they still win that regardless. Especially with the Alawi. Oh, yeah. Call that or... Oh, they didn't kill him. Let's get Runans. Oh, man. I wanted Tier 2 Boots. Actually, Tier 2 Boots, Zeal, and then... Three Potions. Or two, two Daggers is best here. In giving us the maximum amount of stats with the gold we have. And then third item, so situational. But realistically, we're most likely going to get uh, Infinity Edge. And then fourth item, Dom's. I don't know. Lord Dominic's Regard, I mean. Maybe Death Dance sooner or later. Because that provides really good stats, even with the nerf. Lets you survive in uh, pretty bad situations where you're getting focused. And the Blade of the Rune King lifesteal. Can be enough to heal you all the bleed damage that you'll take from Death Dance. And you got Pick Trundle Rip. We should be the one doing pi the picking. Are we all top? Are we trying to take Top Tar? I mean, they're all bot. I'll get a Deep Ward. Use the E to start scouting. Mumu's right there. Oh, there's the Garen. Call it a rip because... Why did you R right now? That was like the worst time to R. Oh, wait. I'm so dead. I'm so dead. Watch. Why? Why, 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 why? Oh, we, should have we shouldn't have committed. I thought everyone was bot. But I stand corrected. We're headed bot. 
to match with the Sahilo. One item to two items. That's quite the ADC diff. They have so much lockdown. We might need the QSS too. Yeah, the QSS. To stop the Vagar from eating me. Or we could just dodge it. Very true. Runans also helps with the wave clear. There's three tanks mid. Oh no, there's four people mid. I can't even do anything if I wanted to do something. So, again, just chilling, farming the side lane because my team got caught. Take that. We're going to back with enough gold for BF Sword. 140 CS. And overall, the, uh, oh god. The Yorick. What the tanky? Yo, we do negative damage to him. The Yorick should be split pushing because it's Yorick. That's what he's kind of known for. <sighs> but now we got that gold snowball lead. Take drag. You guys got it. I'm trying to head topside. And play this fight out perfectly. Kite it out. See? I'm sad. I should have went a lot cleaner. <laughs> and um, I expected York to help me, but he didn't. Um, pick. <laughs> Gotta love the Ash R arrow. Farming this as we head bot side to hopefully take bot tower. Yeah, there you are. Look at top. I like to see that. Garen can actually match him though. That's the funny part. He's five and one. If I had R, the Ahilo would be dead. Oh shoot. That was about to be an F. Ooh, look at the presence of mine giving us mana like that. We have enough for infinity edge and that should give us our damage spike. Third item. I mean, we can go a lot of things. I don't know. Huh. Going triple crit. Wouldn't be too bad of an idea. Yeah, honestly. Triple crit wouldn't be too bad of an idea. So let's go... Uh, Phantom Dancer. Because our, that shield will help us win these uh, close fights. Mm. Sword there. And I'm pretty sure there might be a word in there, so. Ash R! Woo! I am tired. Tired of the tank meta. Help me. Help me. You got Q. Please tell me you got Q. Use your E. Use your. Oh, okay, no, 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 no. You really can't rely on a bard. A bard to save you? <laughs> Like, as if they had the mechanics to. With the Amumu having Thornmail, and I'm guessing the Garen's gonna get armor sooner or later. It probably is best. Okay, oh dear. To get Lord Dominic's regard soon. <laughs> Baited. Maybe even after the zeal. We should opt for that. Soul is up in 40 seconds, which is good stuff. I'm playing these fights out with these two bruisers slash tanks. It's, it's pretty rough. Alright, I'm going to toss out the E. 
to see who's there. Everyone's there. Nice. Help me try to get a pick. Get that pick. I'm literally getting focused by the Amumu. You already know. And he has Thorn Mail. Oh man, the Amumu just stole his stats. And the Rune Ends is just destroying them. Nice job. I'm gonna use the heal. And uh, recall. We have enough for Phantom Dancer. Nice. Last item, Lord Dominic's Regard. And then there's the Mountain Soul. Or the Ocean Soul. Alright, let's take this. It doesn't matter. <laughs> we could take blue. We could take red. Let's see. Oh, wow. They warded. Rip. We killed the ward, though. Ah. No. Not like this. Got me in the E. Killing to the side where the squishy targets are. Am I dead here? Nope. Vigar, I'm pretty sure, already used R. And it's all in the positioning. Drop the W there. Okay. Okay, Vagar. Oh, that E was, was actually perfect. Your last chance. Allow we. Your E helped us shred this set. It's all in the positioning and R picks from the Ash to carry you your games. I don't know if we could close here though. We probably need to play one more fight. Notice how I do, like, no damage to these tanks. Because they love armor. And I honestly hate it. Slows after slows. Heal from the minion auto attacks. And this is looking like a... GG well played. Like usual, if you enjoyed, found it helpful, smash that like, comment, subscribe, turn on that post notification bell, check out the Twitch, join the Discord, follow the Twitter. I'm out.